Kung Fu is the best in the world. When you fight him, do so calmly and carefully. <laughs> so you dare to challenge? That's right. You're scared you can't beat me. <laughs> I keep my word when I say I'll take on anyone. You're no exception. Tell me, young man, with which style of Kung Fu do you intend to beat me? It had better be good or you will die. Aren't you afraid of challenging me? The greatest? I am sure you will die. Do you know that no one has ever beaten me in Kung Fu? Even the sun must leave the sky. I will not budge. You will die! <laughs> the young idiots who waste my time by challenging me. You guards will make an example of this one. Identify yourself. Who are you to dare stop my sedan chair? Now let me pass. Please forgive me. Let's go. Who are you then? Oh, you want a fire? <laughs> Who's there? My lord, Mei Liang was not feeling all that well today, so I came here to serve you. Please forgive me. If my lord doesn't like me, I will go. What? Don't be so silly. Come closer. 
Sir. has been murdered. It's unbelievable. I heard that the assassin disguised herself as Mei Liang, Master. You mean to tell me that Mei Liang was involved in this? Mei Liang was on a mission when a woman stopped her party and held them up. It must have been coincidence. Damn! When a woman kills one of our people, it looks very bad. We are the Tung Chang Party. You must find that damn woman and kill the bitch! or grief is wrong. From now on, I will devote my life to getting those murdering bastards who killed you. Dear Father, I will show them what you taught me in martial arts. The grief and pain inside me has turned to hate. I will avenge your death, Father. For one, no, for ten years, I will devote my time to finding them. I'll sacrifice their lives in your memory. Goodbye, Father. you. Your father was always respected.
On Earth, the good are rewarded, the bad punished. again. How dare she come? After murdering our friend, she, uh, the cunning bitch. We ought to be ashamed. What were you thinking of? Why the hell didn't you get her? We must kill the elusive bitch! I have told all the guards to be on the lookout for her, so please don't worry, my lord. They aren't capable of doing a goddamn thing. She will think we're fools. Leave it all to me, my lord. I have a good plan. Although your kung fu ranks amongst the best, you have one very big fault. And that is that you have far too much goddamned pride. I'm sorry, sir. Staying here for the night. Yes, sir. First, you can get us some food and drink. Yes, sir. Follow me. Is the mistress of Verity Lodge really so great? Yes. You go to Verity Lodge right away. And say that you were sent by a rich woman to talk with their mistress. Yes. She can name the price. If we pay her a good price, I believe she will do a very good job for us. She is a very unusual type of person. She has never failed at all in her life. She is very good. Is she powerful? You can bet on that but she has never worked for a bad cause. The funny thing is that she gives all her money to poor people. I heard that she was a thief.
You really want to know? <laughs> you only became well known after winning the Kung Fu contest we organized and winning the world's greatest sword, which is an insult to the Tung Chang party. But, as you well know, I obeyed the rules of the contest. You're an outsider. You must return it now. You cannot force me to give it back. What? <laughs> <laughs> Search everywhere. Kill everyone. Those murderers. You stay there. Buddha, have mercy on your soul. Whoever finds this little girl, please care for her. She is the daughter of Kao Kua Tien, who was murdered by the Tung Chang party. May Buddha bless you and this little baby girl. Ridiculous, you stupid fool. How can your partner Chen Ting be murdered when you're both sleeping in the same room? My lord, the mistress of Verity Lodge didn't seem to be interested in meeting us. Nor she. What is it? Someone asked for 2,000 tails of gold to tell you how to get the mistress of the lodge. Who is that? Xiao Xian, a lady. A woman? Yes. A woman trusted by the mistress of Verity Lodge. Okay. It's a fair price if we can get her. Give it to her. Come in. Take a seat. <laughs> hmm. 
Now, what are you having? Get me some meat dumplings. Yes, yes. She is a mistress of Verity Lodge. Right. Good. How's business been, my friend, eh? Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> Where's my share then, eh? I hope you're not trying to cheat me. I wouldn't. <laughs> Give me that money, quick. <laughs> uh, hmm. I think, my dear, that you should pay some road tax. I have neither money nor time for people like you. <laughs> God damn it! Is it now? Just after two. Bam! Come in. Someone asked me to deliver this to you. Tomorrow at noon, the mistress of Verity Lodge will lead four women to the entrance of Red Cloud Lodge. She is Kao Ying Lin, your father's murderer. Good. Now is my chance for revenge. Yes, this is the entrance of Red Cloud Lodge. Are you ready? I'm ready. They'll be here shortly. I have no wish to harm you. 
We are in a hurry. Will you please step aside? Hurry up. Get out of the way. <laughs> Why are you rushing? Who are you? Sir. I would like you to help me. thousand tales. I want you to avenge my father's death on my behalf. Hmm. I'm sorry, but I don't think I can do it. You are worthy of your reputation. You are the son of Shi Ye. Shi Hao, the devil killer. And you're the mistress of the lodge. How do you know? You should know that money can buy almost anything. Twenty years ago, your damn Chung Chung party murdered my father. I was only taking revenge for him. my friend. You have now discovered my real identity. I can't let you live. <laughs> Bloody bitch. I never dreamed it would be so easy. Kill her. Sir. Thank <laughs> you. 
You are? Thank you for your help. We have met before. Tell me, who the hell are you? I am a wanderer, with no place left to go. I hope we meet again. What are you doing here so late? My lord, Shi Hao, has been killed by the mistress. I only just managed to escape on my own. What? Shi Hao? The devil killer? The mistress is the daughter of a man called Kwa, whom you killed more than 20 years ago. She uses tornado feet. I remember. She was at Shaye's funeral. We cannot allow the Tung Chang party to be treated like this. You go and find that woman and kill the damned bitch! Her Kung Fu is excellent. It's hard to believe she's a woman. I saw it with my own eyes. Even her four assistants were much better than we are. All this means is that the mistress of Verity Lodge is only pretending to help us while really waiting for a chance to take revenge. 
We have been tricked. Why the hell don't we get rid of her now? My lord, please let me handle her. Sham Chi, you go and take revenge for Shi Ye. Shi Sheng, you go with Sham Chi to get that mysterious man. Sir. Did a come out! <laughs> you will not get away! Try to scare a woman, you bastard. Thank <laughs> you. 
ridiculous. First the Tung Chang party gets attacked by a bloody woman, and now there's a mysterious assassin no one knows about. I want to know who the hell that bastard is. Don't you worry, your lordship. I will make sure that Mr. Severity Lodge will suffer more than you can possibly imagine. Good man. Now you listen. We must catch them both alive so that we can torture them to death. Do you hear me? Sir? Any refuge in death? Huh? You're right. Uh, if the poison gets inside her bones, she'll get amnesia. You mean she'll lose her memory? It's already a miracle for her to last so long. should know more in a day or so. We'd better send her away. I don't think she has the money to pay your bill. What do you mean by that? My brother, do I have to remind you that I am the one who earns all the money? fists of Shaolin, you can go and challenge Chen Hu. Go to your work now. In the name of Buddha, go and teach the people of the Tung Chang party a lesson. And while you're on your mission, you can help Cao Ying Lan to destroy them. There has been a traitor trying to deceive me. I will not forgive anyone who dares to betray me.
as patient as Kao Yin Lan, you should know what to do. The Tong Chan Party! My friend, I think it best we get her another doctor. No. You can handle it. Xiao Xian. Brother, what's wrong? Why did you do it? Tell me, what is your reason? You certainly didn't do that because you were afraid she had no money. She's the mistress of Verity Lodge. Sure about that? Brother, if she stays here, we will all die. What's this all about? I will tell you the whole story. The Tung Chang party already knows that the mistress of Verity Lodge is staying here. They're the ones who asked me to kill her. But how do you know so much about the mistress of Verity Lodge? Our expenses for the next two years come from her own pocket. What's that? Please forgive me. I have already told the Tung Chang party about her and they paid me very well for it. Money was my reason. What was that? You just said those two are staying at Xiao Xian's house? Yes. I saw them both going in there late the other night. <laughs> well done, man. You will be rewarded. <laughs> loved money too much. He was a traitor. Now go and tell Shum Chi that I want to see him.
Where have you been? So late. Just outside. Anything wrong? Miss Cow's disappeared. Miss Cow? There's no trace. What shall we do? What's the matter? Something seems to be troubling you. Kanglong, what do you mean? I know enough about the Kung Fu of Wu Tang to know that it was you out there. What's that? I know it was you because of the way in which you use your sword, which I have here. Kang Long. I want you to tell me why you were trying to kill Miss Cow a moment ago. You knew all? She is the mistress of Verity Lodge. My sister betrayed her secret to keep our family. I wanted to help her. Since she arrived, Xiao Xian's been so upset. She's been so secretive, so peculiar. There's even a tunnel leading to a hut in the garden. Let's go check.
Blood should be paid in blood. I will attend the jewel, the mistress of Verity Lodge. God damn! What the hell is Wang Ying doing there? You go and stick up the poster. The duel will be at the Stone Pagoda. Now get out of my sight! There'll be no more foul ups. Go and get out of here! Sir!
is Tianhu. Tianhu has already set off for the Stone Pagoda. The Pagoda? <laughs> Please have mercy! Please! <laughs> Thank you for coming. You needn't have. One of us must die on the grounds of this pagoda. <laughs> it will certainly be you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oda is with you, my children. Oh. Master! Teacher! You have done well. Teacher, I'll become a nun. I'll follow you for the rest of my life. Stop it. I taught you Kung Fu for your revenge. Now I must do penance for it. Kung Lung, you look after her for me. From now on, this place will have peace, thanks to you.